Welcome to the vlog. Hey everybody, yes, welcome to the vlog. That was Keaton's little obstacle course that she made in our bedroom. Whatever, boxes and pillows, just having fun. I am home from work. Kennedy is at a football game at school and Keaton is here. Shad is not home yet. I'm hoping he'll be off work like any minute and he won't be too late because I am making dinner tonight and I'm doing a different kind of taco salad and I'm starving. So I'm gonna start making it and hopefully he'll be home soon so it'll still be good when he gets here, not too soggy or anything. But usually when we make a taco salad, we just mix in like taco stuff with salad, lettuce, right? And we make a dressing out of salsa and sour cream. Well, my parents, last week they made a taco salad and they mixed Velveeta cheese with Rotel tomatoes and that's like the dressing and I remembered eating it as a little kid and I so I haven't had it in so long my parents put ground beef in it I'm not gonna put ground beef we'll have it with black beans which Shad will be fine with um, I'm so excited to eat and you just mix it with Fritos and whatever toppings you want so anyway that's what we're gonna have for dinner tonight I'm starving so I'm gonna get it started Shad. It's seven o'clock. It's after seven. Seven thirty. No, it's almost eight. And Shad probably won't get off work for another hour. Um, so he said, just eat, and he will eat when he gets home. So this looks so good, you guys. I'm really excited to try it. And um, we didn't use the whole block of the Velveeta cheese and Rotel tomatoes. Kennedy's just sitting here waiting for dinner to be done and we have this leftover. We might just eat that with some 
chips sometime. But anyway, the rest of this looks delicious. We're gonna dig it. And Kennedy and I each tried a bite. She's not a fan. I think it's pretty good. It is a little different because the cheese is warm and you're putting it on top of the lettuce, which makes the lettuce a little soggy. But there's no flavor either. No flavor? It's just like you're eating soggy warm lettuce. I think it has flavor. Kennedy says it doesn't have flavor. My mom did say when they made this last week, she said that she would put in two cans of Rotel tomatoes and maybe that would add more flavor. I mean, I don't know what else you would add to this to make it more flavorful. I think it tastes good, but I also like plain things. So if you make this, don't blame me if you don't like it. But the uh, corn chips are crunchy. Okay, Shad is home. He dug right into the uh, into the taco salad. So, um, but we're gonna get his reaction. I was like, don't eat it, I wanna get your reaction. What do you think? You did have a bite. Yeah. I don't know, it's starting to get a little soggy. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Here comes Keaton. Um, I don't know. I think the other one better. <laughs> Kennedy was a big fat no. She like took two bites of it and she's like, yeah, I don't like it. I agree. <laughs> Is Daddy up. home? Hi. Hey, where's my phone? <laughs> you had my phone and now you have an iPad. Hi. What? You gotta sleep in your bed. Oh, Keaton. Yes, you do. You gotta be a big girl and sleep in your bed. And look at Daddy. He's just as worried. <laughs> can't tell her no. <sighs> yeah, I let her stay up until you got home so she could see you. It's 9... 18 is that right or 9 10 I can't tell it's definitely bedtime And we've been doing so good at reading a story and saying your bedtime prayers What? No, because you haven't gone to bed yet. We didn't do it today. We did it yesterday No, it's only in your bed See, this just proves she's tired. All right, so it's probably a no-go on that salad again. We'll probably stick to the regular way that I make it. I mean, you all try it, play around with it, let us know if you do anything different or if you have a way of making it that's better. Hi, oh, we have a barking doggy. And watch what else you can say. Oh. Hi, it's Barbie. My puppy friend isn't feeling too well. So Keaton is in her jammies. I'm I'm Sophia the first. Oh, you're Sophia the first. Yeah, watch me. Pull. She has brushed her teeth and brushed her hair, and we flossed. Mommy. What? I want to show them the twirl. Okay, show us your twirl. Wow, you do look like Sophia the first, or the or the lady from the ring. And Shaz over there eating the rest of the salad out of the bowl that we determined he didn't really like very much. Well, at first I didn't like it. Well, it's growing on me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't. Yeah, Shad just doesn't like things to go to waste, so. It's actually kidding. <laughs> Look what we had going tonight, you guys. It's actually super rainy and chilly outside and dark so we've had a fire going all evening and i was sitting here doing school and with the fire and i had the office on and totally keaton was playing and hanging out with Keddy. yes yes are you ready to go to bed no yes say we'll see everyone tomorrow don't go away we'll see everyone tomorrow hey everybody so it is the next day it's tuesday 
and it is September 10th and I heard a rumor that Trader Joe's was coming out with all of their pumpkin stuff today. So after work, even though it's a little ways out of my way, I was like, I need to stop at Trader Joe's. I've been wanting pumpkin some things, pumpkin spice, pumpkin whatever, I want it. So I went to Trader Joe's after work today and as soon as I walked in, I knew it wasn't out. I didn't see, I saw some pumpkins, but not pumpkin food items. And if it was pumpkin season there, they would have displays and everything and I didn't see anything. But while I was there, I still got some stuff. I haven't been to Trader Joe's in a while. So I was like, I better pick some stuff up while I'm here. You never know what you'll find, right? So I got some oldies that we've always gotten in the past and a couple new things. So um, I just went in today to in this vlog with a quick Trader Joe's haul. So don't go away because it's fun, it's food, it's Trader Joe's. Okay, we already dug into this stuff, but it is the Trader Joe's pirate booty. We got some of that. Got some of the Trader Joe's movie theater popcorn. This is just nice to have on hand for a snack or sometimes I take it to work with me. This is my favorite chocolate. It's the Trader Joe's milk chocolate truffle. And when I was pregnant with Keaton, Shad would surprise me with this a lot, and it is so good. Um, it says organic, it's not healthy, I don't know. <laughs> it's just delicious. I saw this before, which I've never seen. I was actually hoping for, you know, pumpkin bread. Then I thought, well, maybe I'll get banana bread, but the banana bread had walnuts, and I didn't want that. So I got this, it's pumpkin, or pancake bread. So it's a twist on a buttermilk short stack baked into a sweet, moist loaf. Moist. 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 We'll try it. Looks like it has a crumble of some kind on top. It looks good. Uh, we got the cheddar cheese rocket crackers. These are like goldfish, only Trader Joe's version. I got the garlic sea salt so it has sea salt roasted garlic onion and parsley and it's in its own grinder it's really cool Keaton had these for a snack at church the other day she told us that she got letter cookies and I knew right away so did Shad we were like I bet she got Trader Joe's so I surprised her with these and she's like yes that's what they were so anyway these are pretty good even if you're not a kid we also got into this already but it's just the super sweet frozen corn, we had this for dinner. I got a bag of their french fries, they're really good fries, and I don't have a meal to go with them, so I don't know, maybe this weekend we'll just have them for a snack or something. Of course we had to try, or we had to get the mandarin orange chicken, which with the vegetable fried rice, which is my favorite. These vegetable bird nests are so good, they're like onions, and they're, you bake them, but once they're baked, they're like fried. There's no meat in them. I don't even know what's in them. It's just like onion. It's like onion. Oh, carrot and kale. Onion, carrot, and kale. It's really, really good. Oh, you can fry them, I guess. I have always baked them, but you can bake, fry, and then they come with um, soy sauce to dip them in. And then I saw this. I'd never seen it before. I thought this would be a good thing for me to take to work for lunch sometimes. So reduced guilt, big ziti. And then this is what we had for dinner also. It was the fettuccine Alfredo, and this literally takes like five minutes to cook. You dump it in a pan with a couple tablespoons of water and cook it. Although I did scorch it a little bit. Two items that are not food related I got. I got this Super Lemon Room Spritz with lemon myrtle and spearmint oils. This was only $1.99 so I got that and tried it and I sprayed it in Kennedy's room and I just went up there and it still smells like this. It smells really good and I just sprayed one spray. And then I have seen a lot of people talk about this, the Trader Joe's Shea Butter and Coconut Oil Hair Serum. And then even when I was checking out, the, the employee said it was really, really good. He puts it in his hair every day and Kennedy's been complaining about frizzy hair. And so I got this for her. It was like $3.49, I think, or $3.99, something like that. Um, and he said it goes a long way and lasts a really long time. So I've seen other people talk about this on YouTube too, so we're gonna give it a try. So that is it. That's what we got from Trader Joe's today. Not a whole lot of stuff. And as soon as I hear for sure that the pumpkin stuff is back, is out, then I'll be back. And then we'll do a big pumpkin 
Trader Joe's haul. So I hope you guys have had a great couple days. We love you. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later. Good night. Thanks for watching. Bye.